borrow a sneaker con and I don't know what to wear. I have no, I have no idea. I could wear my North Face jacket, yeah, but just wear the the gilet. This is a childish blank. Shh, you didn't. I did not say that. <laughs> Oh, shaken espresso, please. That's everything, thank you. Oh my God, winter, yeah. Fall, my favorite season ever. Winter mornings is the best, the best season. This is the, the first time I am ever going to sneak a con and I don't know what to expect. We have got an item to sell. Me and Jack, while we were packing, we were thinking like, what can we actually do at sneaker con should we just look at the whole experience because this is me and jack's first time or like should i go there and sell one of my trainers try and trade it or should i just highball everyone because i'm going there with an intention to buy trainers and maybe sell one of my own jack found out some really interesting information last night hey wait 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 is it a nine uk nine so us 10 yeah <laughs> oh it's cheap isn't it <laughs> they go for 1.8 on no, size No, they don't! In size 9. No, they the don't. UK 9, they go for 1.8. It's the rarest size. How? I don't believe it's worth £2,000. I don't even believe it's worth 300 quid. I'm excited, man. I'm excited. Because there's, what, over 300 vendors there? Th 300? There's over 300 vendors yeah. and over 250,000 trainers. Guys, we have to get half half of that. <laughs> <laughs> I want the black and white Nike Sakai's. I want them. Bro. Mission. Hey, yo, that's a mission. And then whatever we get today, clothes or trainers, we'll go home and we'll review them. Okay, we're on our way. We opted not to take the trainers because we just, we, I'll be honest, we just hate them. <laughs> this machine is cash only. <laughs> what do you mean? Yeah, we're on our way to SneakerCon anyway. It doesn't actually look that busy, which is good. When I say everyone's wearing their freshest, freshest creps and gone, it's actually crazy. Oh, what's them. that over there? What's that over there? That cheeky ah, little, little, that cheeky little, flag. is that that little childish piece? Pleasure, bro, pleasure. Yeah, of course, yeah. of course, of course, of course. My Thank guy, my guy, you. my guy, what do you got, like, guys get? Can I see what you got? Yeah. Those are hard, I like those. Yeah, I've got a pair of Ooh, that couple piece. Yeah. I like that, can I check your crepes out? Yeah, what are you wearing? Nah, nah, I love that. I love yeah, that. Nah, respect, respect. Right. Pleasure to meet you guys. Yeah. Pleasure, man. Look after yourselves, man. Initially, we'll have a little walk around and see what's what. And then and then we'll go about seeing if we can buy any crepes, seeing if it's worth it. You know what? Everyone's brooking out their freshest, like, garments and that. So we're bound to see some childish hoodies. I'm fucking so grateful. And hey, let's look around because like, honestly, you can't just buy from one store straight away. You gotta look around a bit. How much are they selling the Quantums for? 485. I got my, oh, my Wave Runners for about, at retail. Is it? Yeah, so 450, you can make that much drink on it. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's yeah. crazy. How much are these? These are ridiculous. Oh my God. 220? Yeah, man. What size is it? UK9. Ah! I'm a, I'm a 9.5 or 10. Guys, yeah, I need yeah. these. Nine and a half, I'll squeeze and I'll, I'll destroy my feet for a nine and a half. I might just come around and change my mind. I don't know yet. I don't know yet. I'm here with a legend right now. Dude. What are you saying? What are you saying? What are you I saying? need to ask you, yeah, yeah, what's the best eBay steals you've ever found? Oh, oh. Do you know what? Last month, I found um, a Nike uh, flea market jersey. Okay. Yeah, and it was actually banging. It was like, I don't think they knew the value, you know, because I managed to get it for like 120. Yeah. eBay started to be a nice place yeah, to yeah, go on, you know. It started to be a nice little spot. I'm not gonna lie, but yeah, man. How you doing, bro? How you doing, man? Good to see you, man. Yeah, man. Yeah, bro. How you doing? How you doing? Record. We'll do it for a hundred. What was Nike's original brand name? Yellow Ribbon Sport. 
What? Blue ribbon score or black ribbon score? You're a liar. I promise That's you. That's not a real thing. I'm going to go for the black one. Unfortunately, that is incorrect. What is it? What's it's the... blue ribbon score. Really? Yeah, I like the Burberry. The Burberry's hard. Yeah, man. The Burberry. Burberry. Well, take it, man. Yeah, man. Take oh, bro. Appreciate you, man. Thank you so much. Just on about we're literally well. talking about. We're literally talking about. It's like, oh yeah, yeah. Like we haven't seen one yet. Have you got the black and white sakos? Uh, see the chorus then. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, that's the, that's one of the one trainers. Like I'm looking for today. How much you pay for them? Eight. Eighty. Eighty. No, I can't. Is it car? Car. Yeah. My guy. Literally, that guy came up to me yeah, and he goes, "Bro, the reason why I got my car." is because of Yoko Fix. Bro, it's the first time I've ever heard that yet. Come on. Bro, almost brought a tear to my eye, bro. Yes. That's exactly why, like, I've made that, like, page on Instagram. It's for, like, just clove inspiration because yeah, I needed yeah, yeah. it. Yeah, for and, sure. Bro, fuck, I love that, man. That's wholesome, man. I love that. That's love sick, that. that's sick. white sakaias i'm actually getting pissed off like i'm just not <laughs> it's just not happening at the moment if i don't find these crepes i'm going militant i'm actually going militant but there's still five crepes though and i've managed to cop and be lucky with a couple of peas things but i need more man i need more give me more feed me right so i'm joined by my guy ramel um, what one? How expensive is your fit today? Tell me through what you're wearing. Uh, I've got the North Face collab um, jacket, but I'm only wearing the like the gilet to it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah, I thought, yeah. yeah, it's nice. So it's the Supreme Supreme North Face jacket. I've got a weekday hat. This is actually a childish um, sure. a childish blank. Yeah, so I've yeah, got yeah. a childish blank on, so I can't really put price yeah. on that. Cole Buxton. Uh, I think these are just straight joggers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I've got a Garmin watch. Fitness. Nice, nice. fitness you know what I'm first. saying? Fitness first. Got silver chain on I think that was only about 2 250 and then uh, I got these Clint's I actually got these two days ago shout out to Junie Clint but yeah these are fire I think these were like two two bills I think oh, yeah, oh, yeah. so yeah and then I got my Polaroid because oh, I like to clean. I like to capture moments I'll actually capture this actually desperate to try these on these are a nine these are a nine and i'm i'm willing to sacrifice my feet to get into them i need them oh i know that i know my feet are gonna suffer but i feel like how much could you go on in oh. what do you think bro can you reserve it for like 10 minutes nah i'm gonna get them <laughs> i knew yeah. you were gonna okay. Duffel bag filled to the T. When I look at what I see, I could truly say that's all me. Pack my things up, make some pit stops. Catch me in the hilltops on the side of the country. Came back from being down 1 3. We the 16 Cavaliers, whole team hungry. Keep the family roots like we came from one tree. One branch, one leaf. Had to embark on this voyage. Double parked in the. I'm back. I'm gonna get one of the small ones. But I don't know which one. I'm getting red. I actually do. I'm getting this, I'm getting this, done deal. Which one do you reckon? The material on that is fire. How much for both? 120? Okay, okay, yeah, boy! We bought four bags off the... How much is these jackets? 85 each. I love, yeah, handmade stuff. How's that? Yo. Dear son, I'm spitting this before you fresh out. If I said I was blessed before, man, let's get in depth now. Yo. Give me a sec, yo, I gotta step out. Hold the on, moment we on. saw the ultrasound, my heart skipped a step. Wow, the beauty oh. of creation, I seen too much. The wonder how it feel to take your first breath for you, I would never. Guys, honestly, I think that was really, really successful. Me and Jack clutched up. One out of three for the shoes, yeah. but I did speak to a guy from Birmingham that said he would be able to hook me up, and he's got the Nike Sakai's in my size. So I'm hoping. 
that it's in good enough condition for me to buy. Proper happy. There's some crazy, crazy shoes there. I'm really loving this content. I'm really, really loving this content. Got interviewed and, uh, quite a lot. Got interviewed quite a lot as well. And there were some people that were talking about the videos and they were loving the past two videos that they we've were. made. They were. So really enjoying it. Really grateful because I couldn't have done this without you guys. I'm going to enjoy the rest of my weekend. Me and Jack are going to get some food yeah, and I'll see you guys in my wardrobe and we're going to go through all of these items, exactly what we got from SneakerCon. Now guys, in conclusion, what items did I actually buy from SneakerCon? There are some very creative and talented people at SneakerCon. I'm not just talking about the people that know how to buy and resell. What I saw at SneakerCon isn't just trainers. There are also people that sell their own garments. They make their own clothes. Wow, when we bought these, these pieces, yeah, I've wore this all weekend. It is so fire. It's such a nice side bag. The people that own this brand, they literally recycle um, vintage Nike jackets and make them into a bag. Originally, actually, I bought this, this bag, this tote bag. Look at that. I managed to get a Christmas present as well, but just so the person doesn't watch the video and know exactly what it is, I'm gonna get Mikey to blur it out. All in all, guys, I bought three bags three bags. I bought this uh, jersey from a company called Crep Star. But yeah, I bought this jersey top. Fire. I might actually just wear this throughout the video. I'm telling you, these Donnies at SneakerCon, creative as hell. Love that. Comfy. It was 85, but he was generous and gave me a bit of discount. Shoe wipes. Clean one of my trainers with it. I love tapestry. This jacket is mad. It's got Batman on it, man. Like, yo, you can't make this up. You can't, you cannot make this up. Actually insane. This is a really, really nice, like, going out for dinner piece. This is essentially a candle. Oh my God, it smells so nice. Air Force One candle. Freya May design is very creative and it smells banging. I'm gonna put this in my office room. It's concrete so it doesn't burn your house down. Last but not least, we didn't get all the trainers that we wanted to get, but we got one out of three. We were looking for triple black Jordan 4s, black and white Nike Sakai's, and the black and white patterns. What did we get? What did we get? We pulled it off. We pulled it off. I'm gonna try the fit on right now for you guys right now. Sneaker Con, my first time at Sneaker Con. I actually really, really enjoyed it. The vibe was insane. eBay, I think, who are hosting it now, smash it. The only thing I'll say is it's very, very inflated. That's why I didn't buy a lot of stuff because I was like, if I went on Depop, if I did my own investigation, I could get it cheaper. But overall experience, I love it. I would definitely go to more. And if there's any more sneaker cons or anything similar, I'll go to those two. I just love what we're doing right now, guys. Thank you so much for your time. Love you guys. I'll see you in a bit.